Hey guys, it's Link here, and I'm here with my friend William. Hello. Today, I don't exactly know what we're doing, so I'm gonna pass it over to William. So we're just we're just looking at the uh, HBO Max uh, same day trailer because Lynx hasn't seen it, and we're just gonna kind of give our impressions on it. The only reason why we really looked at it is because Mortal Kombat is in it because there's a Mortal Kombat movie coming oh awesome yes and that's pretty epic okay I'm ready when you are all you have to do is follow my voice huge action so this is the famous suicide squad is that Suicide Squad? Yeah. What do you Antonio think? Antonio Soprano. Welcome to the Space Jam. Space Jam. Oh, so these aren't going to be in theaters. Well, they're going to be Not theaters crazy. and Space Sand Jam. That one's going to fuck. Venus and Serena going to shake up this world. That's crazy. Oh, that Mortal Kombat. CGI looks good. The streets were made of music. Just listen. Oh, is that the one? There are certain moments that never leave you. Is that, what is it? The little, the little details or something like that. To Mortal Kombat. Mortal Kombat. It's the little things, Jimmy. No one likes to show off. Unless what they're showing off is dope That's as fuck. That's gonna be awesome. Very popular. So it's showing all the movies. Oh, that's why that guy's in the Matrix? What? In theaters and on HBO Max. Yeah, they're, they were recording the fourth Matrix movie. That's crazy. Yeah, I mean, uh, they had some good stuff in there, but the ones that really caught my eye were the Mortal Kombat one, right? And then the King Kong versus Godzilla. Let me tell you something. Tell me something. I'm not telling this to you because you already know this. Okay. But William, William knows so much about Mortal Kombat. We were going on a field trip one day, and I asked one simple question about Mortal Kombat, right? And he goes, let me explain the whole entire universe to you. So as we go on the bus ride and on the way back, he explains the whole entire How, how long Kombat was the bus universe. ride, actually? <laughs> it was like two hours. It was hours. about like an hour and a half. Was it half? Hour and, and a half? half or something like that. But probably two hours because, you know, bus is stretched slow. Yeah. So what? William is... William is probably really excited for this movie. I am, but I'm also not excited for some things. See, like what? I've, I've looked into the, the movie on my own time, of course, and they're, they're taking out... It's, well, it seems like... They're taking out this one character named Johnny Cage, right? And they're oh, replacing like him. him. Yeah, I like Johnny Cage. And they're replacing him with a a new character called like Cole Young or something. What what I don't like about it is they're pretty much replacing this character with a new character. And it's like, why would you do that? Because the character that Johnny Cage was was like the normal guy, he was a struggling actor. Or like he was an actor who was like uh, past his prime, and he's trying to prove himself. So he enters this fighting tournament, right? And then he f discovers mm -hmm. this like this other world kind of situation that's going on, right? He's supposed to be like the like the person like the audience's character like perspective, right? But they're taking him out and replacing him with a new character. That's kind of dumb. It's kind of funny though. I kind of I looked him up. Just to see what he looked like, and I have seen him before. And the guy from Bloodsport comes up, and it's like, the guy from Bloodsport looks just like him. Or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> well, 
Well, I mean, there's different. I think. Um, well, he was based off of John Claude Van Damme. But, um. Well, and it's just kind of, like, annoying because they're pretty much the guy that's taking his place, as it seems right now, is a guy who's, like, an MMA fighter who's, like, past his prime or something. Or, like, not past his prime, but, like, struggling, and then he just discovers, like, the world. It's pretty basically the same thing as him, but instead of an actor, it's a MMA fighter. I don't know why they would change something like that, even, like... Because I imagine a lot of fans like this character, don't they? Yeah, a lot of fans like this character. I don't know why they would do that. It's kind of weird, but... I know, it's really weird. Yeah, uh, we can we can move on, though. I can was he in the original it. game? Like, yes, he was in the arcade was, game? Yeah, one of the original characters. Why would you do that, then? I, I don't know why they would do that. Hopefully... It just, it looks like he's not upset, in... And I don't even like Mortal Kombat that much. Uh, it looks like he's not in the movie, so it's very sad. Maybe they'll pull a, uh... uh like, they'll, they'll have him in there. Yeah, I don't... I hope. I don't know. The movie's coming out April. Okay, now here's the real question for William. Okay. So if you guys... You guys didn't know this, but William and I, like... This was last year, wasn't it? Um... Uh, Are you alive? Uh, in this um, trail or in this thing, right? Oh you know yeah, we had to. we had a yeah, we'll very big yeah. argument. Yeah. Yeah. You mean Brian? So, William and I, I said, we both agreed last year that I think we both agreed that they're gonna join together to fight a bigger force, right? That's what we were thinking. Yeah. So we still think that. But well, have, the you, have you seen is, the trailer for uh, Godzilla? I have is... seen the trailer. Yeah. And since this was in here, we're just going to have to talk about it. Yeah. Do you still think Godzilla is going to win? Okay, so like, okay, first of all, Godzilla should be stronger than King Kong. Just, uh, just uh, off. King Kong is definitely going to win. I'm telling you, dude. The trailer, the trailer, the trailer. See, that's wrong though, because Godzilla's clearly uh -uh. superior. But they did uh -uh. Godzilla dirty in that trailer. They made it look like King Kong was going to be whooping him. What I think is going to happen is, I'm... some for some reason Godzilla is going nuts, and then King Kong's going to be like, "Oh, I gotta, I gotta put a stop to him. He's not going to kill Godzilla." But, like, he's gonna knock or snap, bring some sense back to Godzilla, right? And then the reason why they were fighting in the first place is gonna be, like, probably a bigger enemy or something, right? And then. Yeah, he's, they're gonna pull a Martha. Yeah, yeah, Martha. Martha! <laughs> Don't think that brings all the people Save that are killed back to life, though, so that's a bit. That's, it's a bit of an issue. I still think. King Kong is going to put the smack down on Godzilla. It looks like it, but like I feel like it's misleading the audiences. I told you this last year, though. and you denied it. No, I still and deny I it. I still deny it. I, I still deny it. There's no and way. I think Just because King I Kong can hold win. stuff with his hands doesn't mean he's going to win. King Kong is more intelligent, right? He's the same size now. That was a factor in the last um, argument that was kind of tricky i was like well they're supposed to he's supposed well, to grow on size literally godzilla's a nuclear lizard okay so how, how is a giant okay, ape gonna godzilla survive a nuclear blast dude tell me that just listen just listen <laughs> godzilla may may be heavier but and like may have atomic breath and that sort yeah but king kong is smarter right he's probably stronger i'm i'm gonna say that and with his weapons, like, he can just pull a Captain America and block the atomic breath and do whatever. But know? how does that even make sense? What kind of weapon survives atomic breath? I don't... Dude, okay. he's, he's like a nuke. Like, he's like shooting a nuke that's going off out of his mouth. Hear me out. Hear me out. You know how there's a lot of kaiju within the universe? Yes. And I'm assuming the weapon we saw in the trailer was a kaiju. Like, part of a kaiju. Maybe. I don't I don't I'm I don't calling know. that he's gonna use that 
to protect against. Oh, well, that's what it seems like, because he did it in the trailer. <laughs> yeah, so... I'm just calling it now, and comment down below if you agree with me or you agree with William. Who's going to win um, before they face the bigger threat? Is it going to be King Kong or Godzilla? And tell us why. And tell William he's wrong. Because he needs to understand this. And then you can... Then... I don't know what we're going to do when I find out well, King Kong beats Godzilla. <laughs> Clearly, they're not going to do that, because they're going to say... Uh, how King Kong would lose against Godzilla. I don't know. Mm. What's another? Well, they okay. showed the Suicide Squad. Well, besides squad. that, let's move. They did show the Suicide Squad. Um, I'm gonna move away that from that because I'm just gonna tell you when when King Kong wins, you're gonna hear a lot of crap. Uh, okay. okay. Yeah, 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 okay. So I'm gonna move away and not try to mess with you too much about it right now. Oh. I'm just gonna let my guy do the fighting, you know what I mean? Yeah, 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 I get you, I get you. Okay, um, Suicide Squad, obviously really excited for that. We don't know too much about it. Um, Starro may be the villain. We've heard other things. Um, really cool cast of characters. Um, Space Jam is one that Space I thought was. I'm actually kind of, kind of like. Uh, I mean, I'm good for it. You are. I'm not excited for the new Space Jam. I, I mean, don't they think had it's gonna be able Michael to live Jackson, up to the, to the old Space Michael Jam. Jackson. Yeah, no, Michael. Did you just sing Michael Jackson? Yeah, it's an accident. <laughs> <laughs> Michael Jordan. And now they're having LeBron James. Oh, okay, William. I mean, I'm good with... Yeah, see, Michael Jordan. My credibility just went out the window, so I can't really say anything anymore. But... <laughs> <laughs> but it's but, okay, I understand what you were trying to say. Yeah, but, um... I mean, LeBron James in it. I mean, as long as, like, he does a good job... I mean, LeBron James likes Tom Brady, so that's why I like LeBron James. See, I like I like MJ a little bit more. No, I like MJ better than LeBron James. Like, are you are you upset because it's kind of like they're replacing it? I mean, no, it's it's Space no, Jam not upset two, about that. so it's not a replacement. I just don't know. It just doesn't feel the same, you know. Yeah. I don't know, and I don't one thing. I do not like the an animation style of the, the tunes, right? Yeah. So I saw Bugs Bunny a little bit in that trailer, and I was like, that looks kind of weird. Um, yeah. I mean, it's been a while since they've done a movie like that, though. You know? Where they had um, that's true. tunes with people. I don't, I don't remember the last movie they did that with. Was it just actually Space Jam? It might be, or it might have been Who Framed Roger Rabbit. I feel like Who Framed Roger Rabbit's like an older movie, though, right? It is an older movie. You're right about that. Um, I don't know, but I'm pretty excited for that. I might have to get HBO Max, because I don't have HBO Max. Yeah, I don't know if I have it anymore, actually. I have no idea. I got it to watch Wonder Woman, and that, that didn't really work out too well. <laughs> <laughs> and then I watched Young Justice on it, so it was kind of redeemed. But, um, oh, oh, I still have, have it. Young Justice. Yeah, they have season three on there. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty good. Um, they also have Titans on there. I never really got around to watching it, though. I I heard that was okay, but I, I haven't watched it either. So, um, all right. I mean, I don't know. Well, all the other movies I'm, I'm not really too interested in. Nothing really else catched my eye. Um, my eye. I don't know too much about the Matrix movie that's coming out. I, I think. No, I, hold on. I think they were like filming Saying my opinion it until I get a little, little bit, bit more on that. Or um. That's pretty exciting though that they're going to premiere at the same time. Probably going to destroy movie theaters. But movie theaters yeah. are already being destroyed, to be honest. Yeah. Um. Which is sad. <laughs> is sad, but I mean they'll come back though. Hopefully. Sure. Um, comment down below, what what are you the most excited for from these HBO movies? Um, 
I personally am probably the most excited for um, probably the, King the Suicide Kong. Squad. Oh, you're, oh for no. Suicide Squad, okay. Well, I'm most excited for the Mortal Kombat movie. So. And also, also comment down below how you think I'm wrong or how you think William's wrong. Um, and who do you think the villain is going to be in the next King Kong movie? Comment that down below. Obviously, Mecha Godzilla. Or it's not. I don't. I'm saying it's the next, <laughs> next King Kong movie. I'm saying. The next Godzilla and King Godzilla versus King Kong movie, not just the King Kong movie. I'm sorry. Right. So we'll see you guys next time.